we want to find x, which is the hypotenuse or longest side of this right angled triangle. For a right angled triangle, we can use Pythagoras' theorem. a squared is equal to b squared plus c squared, where a is always the length of the hypotenuse. So this is A, and we can call the shorter sides B and C. Substituting into the formula, the hypotenuse is X, so we have X squared. This will be 8 squared, and this will be 15 squared. Now calculating x squared is 64 plus 225. So x squared is equal to 289. Square root both sides and x is equal to the square root of 289. Calculating this gives us exactly 17, so x is 17 centimeters. Note here that all three sides were whole numbers, 8, 15 and 17. If we have a situation where all three sides are whole numbers, these whole numbers are known as a Pythagorean triple. So 8, 15, 17 is an example of a Pythagorean triple. The best known Pythagorean triple is 3, 4, 5. As we saw in the introduction, 3 centimeters, 4 centimeters, 5 centimeters is a right angled triangle there are an infinite number of Pythagorean triples.